It was a beautiful day for flying. Ernst Kuhn of Neuss, Germany, was piloting his small two-seater a thousand feet above some idyllic French countryside near the town of Gap. In an instant, it became a pilot's worst nightmare. Out of the corner of his eye, he saw an airplane climbing right toward him. So what I did, uh, pull a little bit. Then when you see the video, something happened. I believe it was a rope in my propeller. It sure was. He was ensnared in a cable used by a plane towing a glider. He was dropping like a stone. So what did he do? The first I did was switch off the engine. And immediately afterwards, pull the parachute. A parachute not just for him, but for his whole plane. He wafted into an orchard and walked away without a scratch. I can't understand how it was so, but it was so. It was a moment with, I think, very, very much adrenaline. Ernst was saved by a rocket-propelled parachute system for airplanes made by Ballistic Recovery Systems of St. Paul, Minnesota. The company claims the chutes have saved 199 lives. The technology over 25 years has grown from hang gliding industry, light sport industry, ultralights, to, to really a, a current single engine four passenger aircraft. Cirrus Designs is the first company to build general aviation airplanes with BRS parachutes as standard equipment. Cirrus owner Lionel Morrison is sure glad he had it four years ago when a piece of his wing fell off in mid-flight. I've got the plane under control. Uh, after losing almost a thousand feet in altitude, uh, was able to take it out to a remote area where I deployed the parachute uh, and, of course, floated to safety and, you know, the rest is history. Lionel is pretty sure that chute saved his life. Obviously, without the parachute, I would have had no choice but to try to land it, and I just don't know how that would have turned out. Lionel is back in the air again with an identical plane, and Ernst rebuilt his little bird himself and, of course, installed a new chute before he took flight again. Do you think that you are alive today because of that parachute? Yes, 100 percent. 100 percent. Miles O'Brien, CNN, New York.